AJ said, hope you're loving Tennessee life. Beautiful there. Miss you guys lately. Know you all have been busy. Stay safe. Enjoy life and pray for peace. Oh, thank you, Jay. Uh -huh. On the road. Feeding our face right now. Yeah, we just got them mowing. Driving, don't even know where we're going. Huh. Yeah. Figure some plan pulling dollar store again. catches up with you, you know. Yeah. The world lives. Close, wide loads. I don't know where we're heading. I yeah, you, hard. I want to Fifteen minutes somewhere. <laughs> Said we're at I don't see no mountains or nothing no more. I don't know how far we went. The DG market. Hey, Dad. I'm a farmer's daughter's restaurant. Well, we did. We found it. We're a chucky, man. Chucky? Yep. Got in Greenville? No. Nope. Right now. Same one. 
want to run down there, Bob? That's what my big says. Y'all were officially lost. Hey, Luz. How you doing? 
doing okay, Lisa? Hey, look. Where? Where's that guy? He's going with Chucky. Hey, Sad, you doing okay? Lazy you along the campground, it's Ryan. What are you doing? Need something to drink. Huh? Hey. Ain't got no signal, I didn't hear you. Yeah? Um, yeah, I'm lost right now. Uh-huh. I don't know, I'm on 107 heading east, following the river. Well, that's good, please. Stay up, up too. Oh. Can you hear me? Alright. I don't know, I'm somewhere on heading east on 107, following the river. I don't know. We's just taking off driving, I reckon. Yeah. <laughs> you all watching the live? Nice. Melt of chocolate. Yeah, that's what I told him. I said, y'all, I'm officially lost. Wow. Nice melt of <laughs> chocolate. Colton said hi. They's watching uh, hi, the live. Colton. They're watching the live. I don't know, Colin. but... Yep. I've been Colton's on. My where, friend, if, I, if I if I stay on 107 East, where the world yeah, am I going to end up? Fever. He does. Uh, uh, excuse 81 me. South. Yeah, a shrimp throw. Is that right? And he's feverish. Got one on her. One on her. Okay. One on her. Two degrees. Thermometer. Oh, all right. Right cool. now, he's uh, in the car. Well, right now, I'm just driving to get so, lost. So, now it has a break on school yeah. since he's sick. I sure will. I got, I got my, I got my GPS. Yeah. <laughs> yep, I got you. <laughs> All right. Hey, Colton. That was one of our viewers, y'all. Called me from down here and said, y'all lost or what? <laughs> oh, Ricky. That's good. Where will this take us? He's, he's all the way to Jonesboro. Oh. He's going to make a left. Sorry, y'all. We're looking. Better turn back around. There's 14 on there. Huh? Ain't no turn around. This heads nowhere. Sorry, y'all. Losing signal again. Yeah, um, probably lose signal here in a minute. Might cut us off. Yeah. Cut us off. Our phones had antennas that would pick up. You think? What? Oh, we're back. I eat too fast. If Rye gets stuck in my throat, that's that signal, happens. I think. White yeah, it's that signal. Now we're losing. Well, y'all gonna have to go to these walls. Now we're down to eight. It's getting better now. This video could probably be really blurry. Like Stevens when he's driving around. Yeah. Glory. <laughs> Young Pearl.
Daddy's phone's updated. Did yours update too? Yeah. My phone. It did. You want to I, this match? Show my phone it. finally no, did, and it sucks. No, show I finally got it back to normal. See, went too take late. Take it. Mama's time to take it. What? Take that. Yeah. What? Take what? The, the, the back camera. seat. Oh, this. Yeah, show them out to the side. Hang on for that. Wow, look at the mountains, y'all. Johnson City. 
Uncle Jamie said it looks like you're in Brookville. Well, yeah, it's kind because of. there's no mountains. I mean, there is, but we're yeah, very, very I'm close on them. Ask me if that, that looks like Brookville. Does that look like Brook, Brookville, uh, Uncle Jamie? The window's so clean you can't even see it. It's over there. Them trees are in the way. So it's still clear. That's not where He's on his way to see Miley. What, Miley coming here? The same here. Y'all, uh, on a beautiful drive, we love going out 107 and 81. Yeah. Probably at least. Yeah. The yeah, salt or sell salts. Oh, 
need to clear up some. Mom, we're going to have to help with GPS. Well, let's get back to her. Where are you going to get? Get that and take What the world for? Well, where are we going? I don't know. Oh, no. We've made it to the pumpkin barn. There's the pumpkin barn. Now we're headed back north. Forty, forty-three minutes from Greenville. We took, a, we took a ride. What are you all doing, running, running. moonshine in those mountains? <laughs> Michael Peters said. phone is so hot, I can't even touch it. I think it's going to be so hot, the cover's going to be melted, melt, or melted on there. Look at my chocolate. Look at this chocolate. <clears throat> There's a lot of churches. Huh? That is. Yes. Down, down Nailed the floor. Only four on there? That will be still. That would be. Uh, Maybe they don't like take trips. No, I didn't think we were taking the road. There's only three people oh, on here now. Where are you going? We're going to pull off and get out. Uncle of Homer Sorry. said Somebody. it's beautiful on South 11. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I get we, we won't be done no more We're, of trip. Uh, that Tennessee's a lot better. It is. Better than South 11, but not. at the Dollar General, I'm done. I had to go around about, about got killed. What the, hey, who puts a roundabout, y'all, in the middle of Jeez. East Tennessee? Huh. I can't even, I don't even know how to do them. Did that scare you? That's how I feel when well, I, I didn't even a see car it. comes behind my quad. Well, I, didn't I, even, look, I didn't even see the As soon as I now. look back there, mm, mm, mm. What? What was you shooting at? Let's see what's going on. Hey, we're back up to eight, y'all. I don't know. Oh, let me get that. <laughs> Spelled it. <laughs> oh, we're about in a mess, y'all. Yeah, let mama drive, yeah. I wish I could be chauffeured. Yeah, that'd be nice. Yeah, we about. <laughs> I didn't. I didn't know. She said you got to turn here, and all of a sudden, look, we's in this big roundabout circle thing. 
Yeah, you follow the arrows. You gotta go straight. What arrows? They're half painted. You gotta go straight Look, this way. We gotta sit, see what they do. Watch I'm them. gonna sit here and watch them. Y'all go around this roundabout. Look. You might get lucky to see one crash. The problem, well, the problem is I didn't know if I was supposed to head back 353 or or head up yonder's that way. Here, can you have mama your trash put up back? Your trash bag, so I can put it back next to my. Lisa, Ricky, what about this roundabout? Round and round we go. Felt like I was in Indianapolis for a minute. Come up on this, didn't even know. See, look all these people. Might get lucky. I'll That's the see silliest. Crashing our own eyes. The silliest thing. The things I've ever seen. I don't like them. Just stick to the traffic lights. Oh, no. Look. See, this big bus is coming. Look. Oh! And see, they're not supposed to stop. See? Then he pulls out. Goes right in front of that car. Look behind. See? Look. Oh, I'd be dead. Where we stop, nobody knows. I wish y'all could see it. There's big mountains way back over yonder. I think that's where we're headed back to. Look at my Hershey's chocolate. Melding. It'll Not, still be good, though. Nothing but squish. How's it still melding? What the hell? This sun is bright, y'all. Well, and, I guess uh, that's west. We're talking over at the same time. She. No. Well, I didn't know we was going to drive a country mile. These are llama stickers. The people to the left. Well, that's, er that's everybody's to the left. That's a great <laughs> idea. Ah, that's funny. All that winder over there. I don't know what's all smeared all over it. Round and round you go. You could stick that when on the When you back stop, of the nobody knows. Truck, got it. Connie Gutner. Thank you for doing it, Howdy, y'all. You know, you know uh, I could stick that mm. on your back window. No, nah, I don't want llamas on the winders. Only adventures, hiking things, and hot pans. I don't want llamas. Put me some Carmax on. Need to wipe that window, baby, with this napkin. Not cheer. Oh, well, I can put Look. it inside of the truck. No, you're not sticking that on the window. You're not sticking that. Don't stick it. You gotta put it on your radio. There you go. My radio? Yeah. Oh, you can't. Where the back, or is it too small? That'd be. I had to poke holes in that side up. That side. This. Well. When I put it right here, and then it's a the battery thing. We're all cousins, ain't we? No, it's. Oh. Uh, yeah. Funny. You want this back? No, but don't bore up with that thing. I don't know. I guess we're going to sit here till dark. <laughs> Watch the roundabout. The sun's so bright over there. I can't see nothing. It's not sticking. Well, about eight of white forward when I come around there. Sorry to the white forward that seen Goodson's Adventure pull right out in front of <laughs> I was trying to turn left, but I needed to go right to go left. <laughs> Good signal there. Yeah, we're on top of the hill a little at the DG. That's not going to fit. 
Unless we get out. Uh, like get out. Saw. Get out and look at them. Oh, no. Uh, By that sign, I was going to flip the camera, but... Flip it on you. Me? Yeah, you look fine. Oh. Look, round and round they go. Oh, there we go. Round, fine. nobody knows. I'm trying here. Nah. Look at this honey. No, nah, that's why I said I was trying to go left. Mama said need to turn left. I don't. <laughs> and I needed to go right to go left. And around to go left. And up. Like that. This is hilarious. Oh, see, it says yield. Now I see it. I yield. yield. Well, I yielded for a minute. See, they that went it. that way. We were supposed you gotta to yield. Go. You got to go. They went that way. I'm just being funny, y'all. Uh -huh. I've been in some roundabouts in Indy, so I just didn't expect a roundabout nowhere near here. Can't believe this. Well, we sit here long enough, then we'll, 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 we'll be learn masters. It. We'll be masters at it for sure. Follow right, the round arrows. The, these arrows are half painted, y'all. You can't see them. You just go anywhere you want. Uh-oh, watch them. Here they come. Here, yield. See, they yielded. Oh, I did, they I did down. too, but I did, that sign was bl blocking that big white forward when I looked to the left. I didn't see it. Isaac. Isaac's popping corn. Yeah. <laughs> Bravo. Well, I need my phone so I can see what's around us. Okay. Where? I'm not even in there. What? Sit there long enough, you'll find your way home. That's right. Mama. Why am I not in there? Uh, because I can't get you in here. You're over there. You want to talk? Here, you talk to them then. Here. Here, tell oh. them about it. Tell them about Look it. Look at this honey. Pony. Pony. Pony Roundabouts in Jonesboro. Daddy's calling me yeah. a puny. Right? Roundabout in Jonesboro is about where we're at. Yeah. The roundabout in Jonesboro. I don't think you should have, have, have sent that way. Or went that way. Who's that? Your phone. I gave it right to I gave it to you. Gee. See but when, when I drive, y'all get blurry though. Yeah. Let's see. Where where am I at now? Jonesboro, I think. We're at the wet. We're close to the wetlands. Uh -huh. do that. We are in Jonesboro, right on it. That's what Lisa said. Yeah. Where's the Yeah, but if I take 353, that takes me back to... Oh. Big old bus coming. I gotta go up farther than to hit 321. I'm reckon I need to keep going 353 well, up. He's going the roundabout, look. Yeah, look at him. He's, <laughs> he's big enough to take all the sides of <laughs> How do I get there from here? Take to Simmons Ridge Road. What happens if it freeze, honey? Wetlands Water Park. Cool. Oh Lord, we'd be ten. I, if I turn left, now we're way back where we started from. <laughs> I'll put it on me then. Good Lord, we're 11 minutes from the Brats Zoo. Yeah, that was Larry Cordell. Not Lord, God. God. All right. Head north toward Depot Street. Head north. The Brats Zoo may be closed by the time you arrive. And you take Persimmon's Ridge. That's what I figure. Which way we gotta go? Which way we get there from here? 
Do do All right, let's see if we can. Well, let me get my seatbelt on. Let's see if we. Oh. My seatbelt's on. Dun, da, 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 dun, 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 dun. Ow. Sorry, y'all. Wear a mask to see. Well. Ah, there we go. That was Larry. Yeah. That, yeah. that was Larry. Hold it. Look. Oh. Here, Ooh. hold it firm so we can get me. So I can get lime or lime Lone star. Lone star. That's that's only in Texas. Get my seat. <laughs> Getting well, I'm glad on. I didn't. I'm glad y'all. I didn't go left because yeah. that would have. We would have been back to where we came from because it. All right, y'all, don't watch out for me. Here we come. Here we come. <laughs> Lord have mercy. Boy, it's getting packed here. It's getting packed around here. Wow. Well. You know what I'm about you did today. What did we do today? We ride the uh, mowers. Did you, mowed. Did you ride that? You rode the Kubota again, didn't you? The yeah. Zero turn. All right, y'all. Here we go. Round and round we go. Go yeah. around, stop. Go. I got it now. I'm a master after I've seen them all. Just hit the gauge and go. There's Little Limestone Creek. I didn't know Limestone Creek. There's Swervies up here. The Swervies are on the road. Swervies. You got to hold that up a little bit. All they see is bad. I have faith you can find your way home, Michael said. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, put it up a little higher, honey. It's above the dash. There you go. I can't hold it still. Got to make a weird turn. See, there it is, right there. Park. Right there's a sign to it. Bell. No, to 11 E. Yeah. I should have did. See. Should have went to Don General said pickles pigs feet. Pickle pigs feet at the Jonesboro Cafe. All I had to do was go a little bit farther and I'd have seen 11 E, yo. Oh, hi, Katie. See, that was a good drive, y'all. Glasses on, glasses on. Is there any bears, y'all, around us? Any everybody ever seen any bears in Jonesboro? You must 
be born again. Not another ram, Mama. Another dog ram. Cops everywhere. Cops everywhere. Here, Michael, sir. They turn them. Let's turn the signal. Got a great turn signal. I'd get that. I'd yeah, we're that. about. We gotta watch it. <laughs> <clears throat> they have great turn signals. Some stuff ones Brent Brent's head. Are they blur is they blurry again? That's what truckers call them. Get them boys. Coming over. Another dog. I like dogs. Hey look, there's the mountains again, y'all. That's where we come out of it. I don't know that you see it I'm blurring it out. 65. I reckon we go 65 then. Yeah. somewhere to stop yeah. just ended up in the hills Over here, you just though. need to find 75 South to bring your South to Georgia, Michael said. <laughs> yeah, we might get to we ain't that far from the 75 no, to South to Georgia. Ain't.
That's got the Not best fish and seafood around here, y'all. That's good. That should probably be wondering why I type, how hey, I type so color. fast. Yeah, yeah. Not so. Uh -huh. We hit 75 south, we'd be in Pensacola by 2 a.m. Yep. Keep looking for Jesus. How He's far are you quick. from your camper? Oh, uh, probably 10 minutes. Yeah. There's a zoo. Well, going so fast, I picked it up. Yeah. Try to go there sometime. Well, that's have to go. Remember, we went down to the bottom of the quarry. Huh? Well, I'd we'll go to the picnic table down there again and see if they pick up down there. Or drive down there. Yeah, I'd drive to the down. llamas. Ask me like I'm sitting still, but I ain't too big a hurry. I'm still doing 62. No. Yeah. Everybody's pulled off, picking mushrooms. Huh? Yeah. 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 Yeah, if we, if we get take a notion to go, like take a drive, we'll make sure we record it down through there. I want to go on the... Pensacola is eight hours from me. Yeah, Asheville. Uh, maybe if they call it Asheville Highway. See, they're 75 north, but I think that's a different 75. We sure put the miles on the old Chevy, y'all. Yeah, we have.
lot more common down here than back at home. Yeah, they probably ever see them there. Sun goes down a lot quicker around here because of the mountain. Yeah. Myers has all kinds of turkeys. That's it. Yep. Myers does. It's just not as fun having to get out of your car, drive air, waste gas, get out of your car, get a car, and then and then go in, walk in that store, fight the crowds, find you a turkey. Chair, LOL, just saying. Mm -hmm. The GPS. <laughs> Very little, like you've seen a, if you watched our video yesterday. That's about all we've seen of the clips. Yeah, well, but um, that was blurred. Now where mom and dad is, they video or FaceTimed us, and we were able to see a little bit of it through the that way. But that was. I'm starting to group chat, y'all. Yeah. Is your dirt that red? Right there in Georgia. Pretty red around here. Is your dirt that red, Michael? Yes. It is. I thought it's pretty red around here. have to get a license to get out of bed early and walk through the swamp and woods, I would have mine begged by the time you got home. <laughs> hey, Shad Daddy, how you doing? Shad Daddy in the house. Been fishing, any? Here we go. Here we go. Two wheels. <sighs> Sorry, y'all. I'm trying to hold this straight. I can see the mountains over there. That's yeah. what they're just out of sight because of the tree. Mm -hmm. This phone don't do no justice. You no, go I out on the road. Yeah, you go out on the road. Except they got a patch this road. With We're in the middle of nowhere right dressing now. dressing and tater salad. Yeah. That's right. Ready I sure to... could use me some dressing right now, Paul. Yeah. Oh, we're back at Lazy Llama Campground, we are. Katie. Oh, Priscilla. I want you to snap up for and tell a location on there. Track us down or what? Look here. Look. Llama. Llama poo on the hill. Look. Catfishing today. Did you catch any? Uh -huh. Why? Right here, get out. You can go swing. Yeah. Hope we got service right here. Right there. Right Last there. time it got blurry. Y'all have to tell us. Oh. That seems to be a beautiful place where you're at. That yeah, it is. That it is. I don't. The view don't get old, y'all. Hold that a minute. Hold that a minute. <laughs> Hold that a minute. <sighs> oh, hang on you. Just put something. There we go. 
I pinched my nerve in my back, y'all about killing me. Pack them up so long. I ain't. My back's been a killing me. I don't know what I did. All right. No, hold on. I didn't say. What do you mean, Shad Daddy? You didn't catch no catfish. I might be able to move. I didn't plan on taking that long a drive, y'all. Oh, shoot, bar. Hey, if y'all want to, uh, family back at home, you can just buy that cabin up there on that hill. And we can just run this whole thing down here. And, and we can all just live up there. That is one pretty place up there, y'all. Yeah, that's a that's a pretty place up there. Well, you ain't us two walking on those hills. I, yeah, I'm telling you, it's uphill all the way. No, I don't know. I changed tire on the on a feller's trailer and. Then, Isaac was helping me jack it up and a two by four slipped and I think I, me picking that up kind of hurt my back. But man alive y'all, it was... <clears throat> Boy, I don't know. But I, I'm not sure like if they even uh, thought about listing that yet or, or what they're doing but I sure in the world like that place. Got a, I mean, a huge wraparound porch, two-story, barn. Um, there's a bunch of woods way back off there. I think that's all part of that property. And then uh, I'm not sure if this house, there's a house up yonder. But, yeah, that, that would be something to have all this and run around in. Great opportunity, y'all. Just takes money. That, that's kind of... Yeah, that's the babies. Homer asked how much. I said, I told the family they can just buy this place up here on the hill. Yeah, that'd be nice. <laughs> well, that's the other part of that too, Paul, is money. So, I'm sure it's well over... I'd say it's somewhere in the threes, but I could be wrong. I'd say it's somewhere in 300,000, probably a quarter mil, at least. Get chilly already, mama. Well, there's the grass too, y'all. Me and mama's mowed this. Don't crack on our lines. It's how much land? I don't know. They haven't, like I said, that hasn't been posted, but I think in the near future they might be might be trying to sell some of that. It's I would say it's well over mm, what I'm looking at's well over five or six acres. Now they got more on the other side. But yeah, I get mama went up there. Yeah, that's uh, nice up there. I told him it's beautiful. I like the house, though. It's, I mean, imagine waking up, sitting on that porch up there, yeah, being on top of that hill, and from right where we're at, like from right level, which is about right here, to up to there, y'all is probably probably to that second porch up there is pushing. Yeah, they 
Yeah, this is the, that was all original part of the campground. And then the ball diamonds is over here to the left. Nice and peaceful here. Birds That's what singing. you hear, y'all. Birds are singing. And Chad Daddy didn't catch no catfish. Yeah, they don't want. I can't believe it. You must have been fishing for the big ones, Chad Daddy. You have to throw a night crawler on your hook, and then you catch fish. There's behind us, Isaac, the swinger. Might lie right up in you, y'all. <laughs> Where are you going? <laughs> well, I wanted to see that up back here. That yeah. Next mountain on top, so that's straight across from that house. <laughs> Isaac swinging away. High as he can get on that little thing. It's going to break one of these days. Yeah. It's quiet, ain't it, Mama? Yeah, it is. Just a swing in. Hey, James. Thank you for joining Not us. Not yet, Michael. Not yet. It, yeah, we got it. It has rained and wind has blowed uh, for three days. Yeah. Ain't it, Mama? Yeah, we finally had a sunny day today. It poured it, so like it dumped right on top of our camera. It was like I, midnight or somewhere, y'all. It. Oh yeah, it. Yeah, don't need the license till we go. Yeah, I got pretty warm today. It got nice today. I was in shorts, still in shorts and t-shirt. I had a tank top on, but I still have my... It's cooling off now. As soon as that sun goes down, it feels mm -hmm. like it cools 10 to 15 degrees. I'm watching this llama. That black one's coming. Okay. They're kind of... Wow. Kind of far away. There we go. Our lines are pretty. <laughs> yeah. Our lines get a little squirrely, but it's cut, y'all. <laughs> that bugs me, but I can't help it. It's so hilly. <clears throat> cut, at least. Two of them llamas, they got lazy and laid down. Yeah. Chewing their cud. That really shows it, don't it? Yeah. Mama was chasing a snake right here, she was, somewhere. Oh, yeah. No, that was me. That was you. <laughs> <wasn't See? it>. <laughs> <laughs> that's one thing about, that's one thing about Tennessee. Seems like they got a lot of rules mm -hmm. for the fishing and stuff. Mine yeah. looks straight to Oh, that is not too bad. That, that one's a little squirrely. <laughs> <laughs> and we both was on it. About right beside each other. Hope you're enjoying life in Tennessee. Jay Smith, yeah. Yeah, thank you so much. Oh, we're we in shore waiting. I got fishing fever bad, y'all. Yeah. I got it real bad. Right when I go, I told mom I'm gonna keep her out there for a couple of days. Yeah. 
<laughs> Miley said she loves you, sweetie. Not worried. What do you do, Ron Doll? No, he's back there still swinging. He's still swinging behind Mama. He's back there. Yeah, I ain't enjoying it here. It's I don't know what to do with myself, being with Mama and the baby all day. I <laughs> have two before for the handle. I'm ready. I want. I like see. Yeah. I like see my line broke. I wouldn't bother me a bit. Y'all. Yeah. On the dip net. Yep. Uh, me neither, Michael. I am dying to get them things suspended. Yeah. We're gonna go. I'm hoping soon. Yeah. I am I'm hoping soon. The boat's sitting there full of water from five inches of rain we got. Oh, you didn't tell her up? That's all she got about right there, Mom. <laughs> It's sitting on a hill it this way, and then straight. You, you, yeah, and then you jack it up, and all it does is level it out, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> you hot? No, I'm about cold. <laughs> he gets out shorts like it's hot yeah. outside. Oh, I knew it's full of yawn. <laughs> Gee whiz. Yeah. Oh. That makes a bad I learned that there that. ain't no skipjack in the Cherokee. In Cherokee. Oh. So I can ride up in it. <laughs> Let's set back a little. Oh. Got shorts and t-shirt on myself. Michael does. Yeah, I got my work clothes. This shirt stretched out. <laughs> the V-neck or whatever turned into a U-neck, y'all. I'm a mess. At least my hat looks good, Mama. Yeah. <laughs> well, kind of. Don't look good on me, but... I got a little hair back. Yeah. Got my fish bone. <laughs> I'm a mess, y'all. Cold, I'm still, still, got, still got grass on me. <laughs> yeah, it blowed all over us. The the I'd wind was the wind was blowing 500 mile an hour. Yeah, <laughs> these llamas crack me up their ears. They look like I don't know. They're just funny. Oh, I heard a big, <laughs> big blue just on the water. Oh, they said it. Yeah, it is, okay. Yeah. yeah, and that's why we ain't been in a hurry. We, we've we been keeping the update, y'all, on... South Carolina. Um, with the people here, and they said the crappie ain't even come up yet to spawn. They're still holding back, and I knew they would be. And it'd be the same way back at home. We're getting a super late start, and it's probably going to get 90 degrees, and then the water's going to raise up too quick, and, you know... It's going to be one of them years, I think. I enjoy the quietness. I, mm -hmm. it's, I think that's it's just so quiet. How must have been big? How yeah. <laughs> there. Uh, oh, I'm dying to go. 45 minutes, ain't it? I watched old Dave, Paul. He called a 50. Michael said crappie's been fighting crazy there yeah they've been catching them it's not that they've not been catching them but i heard that they ain't like spawned up yet they haven't come up <clears throat> isaac must that mama's looking at us look at it me me <laughs> he's looking at us look oh no or now he turned. Of course. You make any noise and they act like it. Like this. Oh. Oh, hiccups. We got 52 last week. Oh, that's funny. These llamas. You walk up there, though, they walk back to the barn. Oh, he's a looking again. 
I wonder what kind of noise llamas make. They go bleh, or sound like a I'm deer. Not sure. or I don't ever hear them make no noise. <whistles> I just called in the bird. <laughs> Oh, it's going to lay down. Oh, take me a rest. Just to lay down there and sleep. <laughs> Let's see if the black one's going to join them. Moo, moo, moo at them? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's right. Well, when the oh. donkey starts hee-hawing or whatever up there, they all look and head up that way, don't they? Yep. They're kind of an educated animal, y'all. I guess that's why people are so fascinated with them. I think I, all they do in Tennessee talk about fish that, and just saying. Yeah, I've, we've just been talking about it. It's all we've been doing, Paul. Yep. I'm tired of talking about it. I'm ready to do it. So. We are struggling to get two days in a row off because everything's getting booked up but me and mama's going to get on a schedule and we got to get our phone calls done and yeah. and try to schedule our days in being as we kind of get caught up well i mean i don't know if you're ever caught up but i'm saying once everything gets booked and stuff I'm, I'm, yeah because if we take off cherokee we're gonna have to get up in the morning i'm gonna have to have the boat ready the night before and Oh, because donkeys are a protector, we keep them with their calves. Wow. Yeah. I guess llamas are good watchdogs, too. Um. Oh, wow. That's true. I've seen that. I've seen videos of that. Yep. Donkeys don't mess around, y'all. Dad, he had horses, and I hated horses. I didn't care too much for donkey either. I, do. I like. They make me laugh when they. Do well, they're that. fine to have as long as you don't ride them. They buck you off or. A, a uh, gnat bites them on the hind end and they go running off in the other direction. I don't, I don't get it. Get dark on us. Yeah. Other oh, dogs that, figured that out real quick. I'd say they did. Well, we're glad to get 80% of the yard cut. Now we still got about... I still got another about three or four hours of weed eating to do. And I was hoping my back's going to be better by tomorrow or Monday anyway. I hate not getting it all done. <clears throat> but I got to weed eat around all these boats. And then I'm already getting stopped up again for mowing. It don't bother you as much, I don't think, does it, Mama? I don't think. <clears throat> Mama's got good allergy protectors, but every time I mow and weed eat, I start getting froggy in my nose. <clears throat> All this stuff, get it in my throat real bad. You do? <clears throat> kind of do. Just got to keep clearing it. The black one gave it up, Mama. Oh, he does lay down well. Well, there's two left standing. Well, a bunch of lazy llamas. One gets up, one goes down. <laughs> well, I got... Oh, thank you, Michael. Oh, bless Appreciate your heart. that. Bless your heart, Michael. Really, we really, really appreciate y'all. It's gonna... It's, a. Uh, I was hoping Mama would get an update, but y'all's gonna be able to pay for our fishing license and get us back on the water. And that little extra sure does help. Yeah, it does. We back in the 50 it. in Fort Lousy. <clears throat> I know it. That 
uh, he went, I think, uh, went to Cherokee, and it wasn't even in the 60s, and he thought it would be, so. We really do appreciate it, y'all, really. Yeah, we do. Um, it's the only way. We're still praying and praying and praying that y'all share and hit that subscribe, and, you know, we get over this thousand mark. I'd like to see that reached. I, I thought it would already, to be honest with you. Um, by now, I mean, we gained a whole lot. I can't say yeah. we didn't gain, but I figured we would gain a bunch more. And probably because we're too busy doing this, but y'all, time. Wow. Wow. You sure you meant to do it twice? <laughs> <laughs> that thanks, Carl. Lord help us. And we appreciate you. I really, really pray that the Lord blesses y'all. Um, thank you, Michael. Yeah, thank and, you, uh, Michael. God bless y'all for supporting the channel. And, and uh, we, we wouldn't be able to do this without y'all. So that's, that's, right. that's, what, that's what's so important is to, you know, get out here. And, and we continue. We stay in religious to the, to the lives because it's the only thing that's helping us go another mile. Yeah. And uh, y'all, we're just barely making it. I'm I'm going to be honest. Um, I'm sorry, I'm missing busy, Gary. Yeah, nice to have you back, Gary. We appreciate we you, love Michael. You so and how Paul said John three sixteen. Nice. Yeah. And um, yeah, we just don't know how to how to thank you all enough for what you have done and the supporters and. You, you gain a few and you lose a few. There's a lot of people um, that we miss that was on here and supported. And, and I want to let you know we haven't forgot about you. Um, the stuff that they've sent um, through the P.O. box. Um, we don't know if we're going to be able to continue that P.O. box, y'all. So we will uh, keep you well, updated on that. Yeah. So. You yes, you, yeah, and you and sure Michael, got our back, Michael, Michael. you've had our backs. Yeah, Even when it's against the wall y'all's helped us out yeah um and it i mean i, I don't know I wish we could just hug your neck is really what That's we right. wish we could do and be in person to thank you and um but thank you so much and like i said that's going to cover the license and i want to get a trout license i would i really really want to do that it's not that far go down to paint creek they had some golden trout down there i would love to catch something like that just because it's they, they stock it religiously down here and it'd be awesome to be able to get a trout stamp too and yeah uh, mama's never caught a trout and y'all they get they get pretty good size so and bring those back home and, and cook keep. cook that up and that i think that would yeah keep them and i'd like to try a wild stock trout i think yeah, that'd be right. awesome so, but i had a uh, I had joy. <laughs> Unbelievable. Thank you so much. Thank you much. so much, Michael. And uh, so we pray that we're able to be sustainable. And uh, thank you, Michael. And we will, sure and we'll you. tell him he's he's warming up in the truck and. Um, Y'all, I, I, I read last night in the Bible, and, uh, and, uh, and yeah, you, you're, so, you're so welcome. And that's what I'm going to get into for y'all tonight. Um, it's going to get dark on us, and we'll get Isaac back up to the camper. But I was reading, um, I know I ain't been getting the Bible out, but I've been doing a lot of reading. So I got a lot on my heart, and I just want to kind of share it out there with you. Um, but if you look up joy, I got to thinking about it. I got up this morning and started reading. There's so much scripture, like I could spend the next probably two hours going through the scriptures that talk about joy and how the Lord has given us such joy. And uh, there he is, Isaac's on the phone with my, that's cool. Uh, and, you know, you go, you go all the way back how God has given us joy and i thought how important it is to be saved and how important it is to trust in the lord and when you go through hard times and you go through doubt you still have joy 
and I think that's what I've seeked after as a husband and um, as as a father and her daddy I'd like to say daddy to Isaac and and to any anyone you know if got kids that you find so much joy in spending this time that it doesn't matter how much money you have like me and mama just traveling around passing each other mowing grass and I was thinking how blessed and how happy I knew that she was and we're able to do that together and I think that's worth you know more than anything and I hope that this journey is going to open up um, amazing doors I we, we don't know um, you know I, I guess probably why I'm talking about joy is just kind of what you mentioned there and <coughs> that <clears throat> um, y'all see us all right but anyway I'm, I don't <laughs> stay too much longer but I, I want to pray tonight that y'all find joy and if you're looking for joy in the world that joy doesn't last very long it only lasts for a very short time and uh, you know I got to thinking about a lot of people that we know that is struggling very dark already I'm um, gonna have to go to the truck well let's move to the truck I guess oh he's on the phone uh, I don't know if you, you want to walk into the camper well if it'll pick up in the camper we can walk there and then I'll Well, I know he's on the phone. It'll be loud. <laughs> Hang on tight. We're, I'll walk up there. Hopefully it don't cut out on us again. Out there calling her. Yeah. The moon, yeah. The video still all right? We pray for him, Dad. Made it. I'll wait for the key. <laughs> yeah. Are you still with us? Blurry as all get out. Is it blurry? Said they can't wait to see us get back fishing, Gary said. I know it, buddy. You're... We are waiting. Now the last time we did this, it got blurry on us. I want to slam it in. I saw her. Nice. Yeah, hopefully it pick up better there, Mom. Yeah, it might. So yeah, y'all. Uh, but I had it marked in my Bible already from this morning. And, uh, And joy goes on for, you know, like back in the index, it'll go on for. Somehow I lost y'all. Think it's my end. All right, Michael. 
we should be back on. Um, I can't wait for summer to be here. So seven o'clock ain't so dark on us, but yeah. Um, I know I know that we'll stay on here, and I know y'all be able to watch it. But you know your joy can be restored, y'all. And um, you know you I want I, I can't even like I can't even begin to start on all of what the Lord's joy is and what it means to me. There's joy in everything. There's uh, yeah, Riley's. You know, and I think the greatest joy that you will find is when you're in these trials and when you're in these tribulations and uh you know and you're in all that i'm praying uh for a specific person tonight that was on my heart and i won't mention his name and nina and lisa and donnie and and all all of y'all um you don't have to stay in that doubt and that sorrow and that turmoil and that strife and, and all that negativity. You don't have to stay in that. You know, if I think that's the greatest message today is we go to church to get joy. We live our daily lives with devotions. We wake up praying. We go to bed praying that we find joy in, in our everyday and, um, you know that was part of this journey for me is is for my family and and for my wife and for Isaac and and somewhat for myself you know of course and um but I think that y'all find out that every day we struggle with things every day you know we wake up and you know maybe something just you know hits you right in the face or something you're worried about and people but you can claim the victory, you can claim the joy, you can claim all that. You don't have to have everything, like, is not going right. And I know there's a lot of people tonight, one specifically is just, uh, you know, struggled for quite some time. And, uh, you know, if I was back at home and telling you, I would tell you the same way. You just quit doing that. Quit living that way quit worrying about it worrying i've learned is not going to fix anything worry doesn't fix anything worry brings yourself down worry brings negative things out of your mouth worry brings negativity in your heart and you lose your joy and all that you see is that negativity everything's negative so you don't have to keep living like that you can wake up in the morning give all he said the bible teaches us jesus said to cast your cares upon him why because he careth for us so much so that christ died for you he died for me and jesus died to be resurrected on the third day like was prophesied he rose and conquered death and uh, he conquered hell, and he conquered the grave. And uh, so I want to encourage you tonight and that you don't have to worry about it. Because you, uh, you worrying isn't helping you. And get my headphones on. And you worrying is not helping the next person. But I've seen a lot of people do... And go through a lot of things, a lot of struggles in their life, and they kept their joy. And the reason they kept their joy is because they had their faith in something greater than their trouble. They had it, their faith in something greater than uh, that what they was going through, and they had their faith in the Lord. So uh, we've made this journey and a big step of faith Yo, too, and to find uh, find this again? joy. Um, that we can we can find not yeah, like you don't move down here to find joy in the world but it's it's part of the journey that gives you joy when you put the Lord in every step that you take so I want to encourage you Riley. know not only you but all all of YouTube and all of watchers and churches too I mean nowadays it seems like why why does you look around a church and you don't see that happiness that joy that rejoicing 
you know, that we used to have. And I'm wondering the same thing. Where the God has not changed. You hear me, Miley? Ain't that right, Riley? God has not changed <laughs> at all. You know? Riley! Riley! Look at him. He's, <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, he's right there. <laughs> Riley? No, too. what? So. The only way, the, the only way I can, the by. only way that I can tell you. Oh, there's Jackie. Uh, <laughs> what's fun, y'all? Nice to have y'all. And, uh, but the only way that I can tell you I is to, like, that bombastic, a lot of people. A criminal offensive you know, side eye. I don't know how to say it without preaching something at you or just telling you like it is because that's just kind of like I am. Some people will want to live in that negativity because it's feeding what what they're really wanting and sometimes all that is is they want love back or they want some kind mm -hmm. of an attention back different. you know they they want uh, they want something right. in return so yeah, as I think so. so as as they're living in that turmoil of negativity anxiety depression all that negative things as they're living in it, they're gaining and feeding that negativity, feeding that depression, Baby feeding that anxiety, shot. and it keeps wanting more, 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 more. And as more that you feed it, the more you're going to rely on it. And I think that's the hardest thing to break. You what? need to, you worrying about family, sickness, this, that, I've learned does not get us anywhere. It, it it actually makes us lower. So, and uh, yeah, I ain't right. gonna miss it. So, I want to pray tonight for all of those like that, that is struggling with that, and not saying that we all don't struggle. We all struggle with mm -hmm. worrying about mm -hmm. something, and um, you know, I'm not saying it's just natural for us to do that. But you can remain joyful during sorrow times. So, reading your Bible, y'all, I just keep yakking about, kind of repetitive, but that's what joy is. Joy can be restored. Joy can be in tribulation. Joy can be in the church house still. Joy can be in your home. Joy can be in, in any dark road you might be on. You can still find joy, and I've learned that uh, through serving the Lord and not even if someone's negative about something, I don't have to be negative about something. You know, I don't have to be negative back. I can be more positive back, so... Um, there's a, there's some people that, that's going Yacht. through, hey, there's some people that's going through some <laughs> really, really hard, uh, oh, no. Riley's butt. Nope. Um, oh, Riley. Riley's tangle. He's, he missed us. So what I'm saying, there's some people that's struggling, going through some hard times and, and I've prayed for you for quite some His time. Daddy. Um, I prayed, prayed for you for quite some time, but I also see that sometimes you have to want to change. So you can have all these people praying for you, but until, until you believe in the prayers, until you have the faith that God is able, you're not going to change. You're going to stay in that negativity. You're going to stay in that anxiety and you're going to stay in that depression because you're not wanting to change it. And anxiety and depression and all those things that people go through, like I said, that that those things are hungry. And then in your mind and in your heart, when you're feeling those things, you you speak negative that you might gain the negativity back. Does that make sense to y'all? So if you're if you're preaching positive, then you're going to gain positive stuff back. If you're sending out positive stuff in return, you're going to get positive stuff back. Shad Daddy said hi, Isaac. Uh, huh? Shad Daddy said hi. So oh, I want to pray oh, tonight. Hi. Hey, we're going to go in prayer, okay? Okay, okay. And uh, okay. so I just want to thank the Lord tonight that I got joy. I got joy outside of church. I got joy on Monday. I got joy on Sunday. We try to stay joyful. Not saying things don't get hectic. Not saying we don't get tired. Not saying we don't do that. But we still can remain joyful. Yeah. You might not feel joyful, There's but you'll have joy in your heart. Does that make sense that we See, can 
feed positivity that we might gain positivity back. So I want to encourage you <laughs> all so much that um, you just, you got to want to change it. You got to want to wake up in the morning and say, today's going to be a different day. Today, I'm not going to think on those negative things. I'm not going to think of worst case scenario. I'm going to think in a positive way, and it's going to make you do okay, positive things. So remember that, y'all. Look at our Bible As we go in prayer tonight, we thank you all from the bottom of our hearts. Thank you for the super chats and helping us along the way. And I hope to get a little deeper. I'm praying, y'all, about next week, digging into a scripture um, sitting I'm by myself and too. and giving you all what the Lord wants me to give you. So I'm, um, I'm broke with robots. we're going to pray about that. I don't know what day. I, I'm still trying to pray on that. I want to do it sometime probably early in the morning because it's kind of a slow time. I think I could put a short video 20, 30 minutes in and, and give you all that. So still praying about it, y'all. If you want it, hands are cold. If you want it, give us a, a thumbs up. If you Daddy's want like a, maybe, I don't know how to put it, but I want to, I don't want to say I'm going to be preaching at you, but I might be corn. preaching at you. So, mm -hmm. um, uh, that's it. I think y'all, we, we searched this over and I'm still, I'm still wondering what, what happened to the power of God? What happened to the power of prayer? What happened to, um, having joy in your heart on a daily basis? Oh. Um, what happened to positivity, what saying? happened to the encouragement of others. And that's one thing yeah. I've noticed about people in East Tennessee where we're at. There is so many, if I was to walk up this hill and I had a flat tire, I guarantee you that I guarantee you that I could have five people, probably five people. If I said, I can't change my tire, there'd be multiple people down here to help me change my tire. And if I didn't have the money for a tire, they would probably lend me theirs. That's that's the difference in people. They they know what it's like to be in a hard time or a hard situation. And they're willing to help. So thank y'all for that's watching this. If you're here, you know where we're at. Thank y'all for um, you know just inviting us in like family and being family toward us and and being so um, just encouraging and and helpful. Like I had a guy today come up and you know hey if you need help cutting grass let me know we're here to help and that like that means a lot because you can go these people don't owe us anything you know they these people don't even they've only known us for a couple months you know so willing to help someone else out that that shows the greatest love of god there that i can see and, and some of these people might not even some of these people might not even go to church or some of them might not even be believers y'all so let's go in the word uh let's go tonight let's pray and uh listen if you're watching this tonight I'm probably quit, get this connected back here. you know quit struggling get this connected back there. you you got to want to change you know what i mean you you've got to want to get up tomorrow and say, I'm tired of living this way. And if you're not tired of living that way, if you're not tired of living in the negative and anxiety and the depression and, and all these things and you don't want to change, you're not going to change. It doesn't matter. I could probably pray all night. And you, as oh, long as you I don't want to accept to the power of God, accept that God is able to come in your heart, change your thoughts and your mind and do something different, you're not going to want to do that. And I've learned that, that people got to want it. You got, if you, if you want it, you go get it. You know, that's, that's the kind of thing. So keep, keep the faith in God, knowing that he's not about negative. He's all about positive. God encourages us. He says, fear not. And, um, so let's pray tonight. I hope you hear the prayer. I hope you want to make a difference tomorrow and glad for the encouragement. Thanks for the support. Dear Lord, we thank you for this night you've given us again. Father, I'm so thankful in our hearts that others, Lord Father, has um, helped us a along the way. And, and Lord, I pray tonight, especially for those that struggle. struggling, Lord Father, tonight I know so many upon my heart. Uh, Lord, I pray that you, um, that you touch them tonight in a mighty way. Lord, I pray tonight that... Um, yeah, I, I know we're not able to be there, but I know your spirit is able to encourage them. Father, that they get up maybe on Sunday morning and want to go to church. I pray that they get in there, they hear the word. Father, that they're encouraged in a mighty way. 
And Lord, I pray tonight that all negativity and depression, Lord, Father, would leave our hearts. Father, that we could wake up with joy, not having to worry about things in which we have no control over, but knowing that you know and, and that you hold tomorrow and let us understand that your will will be done and not ours. And Lord, we're uh, so thankful and we're so joyful in our hearts. Thank you for this opportunity. We pray that you continue, Lord, Father, to bless our journey. Father, that you continue to open up doors, that you lead us to the right places, Lord, Father, to help others in need and and wherever, Lord, Father. Sometimes uh, we just need to step out on this faith and ask you, Lord, Father, that you would move in our life, Lord, Father, that you encourage us and and uh, Father, that we can make a difference, be a light in the dark world. We thank you tonight. In Jesus' name, we pray and ask all these things. And we say amen. Amen. And amen. Yes, sir. We appreciate y'all. Yeah, and uh, I'm, I'm praying for you. And uh, I hope that if you're looking at this, you know, if I'm talking to you, um, you're so welcome. quit worrying about things that you have no control over. It's just oh, yeah. going to bring not yeah, only you down. But also the negativity that you're yeah, living yeah. with might bring somebody else down. I just knowing that in your heart you don't want to do that. Yeah. You worrying about something you can't change is not going to fix anything. And Love in the long too, run, Barbara. in the long run, it's going to hurt you. So be positive, be positive, and stay wow. positive. Wow. Knowing every day I wake up, every day the things I get to do, I'm thankful. <clears throat> and uh, we all don't feel the greatest every day. And yes, one of the greatest messages I would love to get out, and I've shared it. And Paul shared it tonight. If you want to hear, I don't, I, don't judge him. Don't judge the message or anything. I just want you to listen to it if you have like 45 minutes of your time to look up. Jack Hiles, Jack Hiles, that's H Y L E S. God is still on the throne. He God. preaches a message. God is still on the throne. That has so probably, that, that message, I, I, all I know is it had to come from God. It came from real experiences in life that he was able to uh, give that, God. you know. Um, sure. that education in the message you'll be able to read it but watch it for if yourself say, jack hiles god is I still on the throne it's an old school message um it's old Let's listen go. to it listen to it it will it will change your thinking but remember no matter if you're up or you're down if it's dead or if it's alive god is still on his throne so just remember, we got your back on your new journey. We'll do all. And you, that you have. We that you have. That, Michael. And, uh, you know, one person, y'all, just like That's that. Right, just like Dad. Michael, one person has made a big difference mm -hmm. in our life. Just one person has made a big difference for us in YouTube. Um, one video, one person, one dollar. You know, like, isn't that, isn't that it? Mm -hmm. That's how it works, you know. Just one person, so. Thank you. I hope if you're lost, you get saved um, before it's too late. I believe God is still on his throne. But one day, God's going to step off his throne. And he's going to step out in the clouds of glory. And uh, then then every knee will bow, the Bible says, and every tongue is going to confess that he is Christ to the glory of God the Father. I hope you're ready. Stay tuned. More journeys coming. More adventures. Uh you made a big difference. No, nah, you've made a big difference in us too. And uh, we we are really praying about where God wants this channel. Mm -hmm. John 3, 16. I'm glad that God loved me. God loved Mama. Mama's a miracle baby. Isaac is a miracle baby. I'm just a miracle still in the making. <laughs> and uh, So uh, God has been good to us. God has called us this this man and this woman from two different mm -hmm. backgrounds, two different Wait. everything, and has brought us together in a, in a bondage of marriage and, and in a bondage of our vows under the oath of God. And, um, you know, God bless you too, Michael. We, we'll see you next week. We, me and Mama will be working on 20 yeah. years. It's going to be 19 years next yeah. month, y'all. 19 years. 19. So 
I can't wait to give her something special. I hope and pray that I, if I had enough million dollars, I would give it to her, but I would like to do something special. Um, the Lord have his way on our 20th year anniversary. So yeah. uh, it would be 19 years. Yeah. So we love, love y'all. We all. miss y'all too. And miss your presence. We do. Yeah. Getting that red Dodge and hit 75 South. Yeah. I did it. Get off on Corbin. Oh, thank you, James. So appreciate much. Appreciate you, we James. Appreciate that so much. And, uh, see, you I know, uh, you make us not want to close it out, y'all. That's just the way it is. Kind of like a good old church service. Yeah. <laughs> Hard to come to an end. And uh, thank y'all for everything you've done for us. And uh, may the Lord just bless you, heal you, sustain you, keep you. And uh, we'll see you on the next one, y'all. We love you. Oh, I just love hearing you preach. I'm a Christian myself. I lost my wife a year ago, and I just don't know what I have done without the Lord. Oh. I love your prayers. The Lord is nothing but precious. That's awesome, Gary. Oh, what happened? I will give him a toy. Oh, what happened? Thank you for that. Thank you for that. So, we changed our color. We we turned red, y'all. I don't know. Oh. Oh. The child loves the new toy and sleeps with it every day. The Bible said where two or three are gathered in his name, he is in the midst. So. Yeah, that's you, Gary. Bless you, Gary. Sorry to hear that. But remember, God, God is good. still mm -hmm. on his throne. On his throne. He cares about you and he loves you. And uh I know I've I've had to put a lot of trust in the Lord in the last few years myself and mm -hmm. And uh, every day I wake up, I'm thankful. Go to bed, I've been trying to be oh, thankful. And uh, really just wanting a whole change of life and enjoy what God's given us and do yeah. things I can do while I can do them. And uh, so, been thankful. And uh, I know God's been good to you too. So, and uh, look that up. Jack Hiles. Can't tell you much more than that. But God is still on his throne. Thank you, Gary. I'll keep praying for you all. You're good people, and I love your show. We thank you, Gary. We appreciate you, Gary. We got a we fan base. We do. We got, a, yes. we got a fan base that's rock solid, that's yeah, for sure. That's, <laughs> so, yeah. that's awesome. We're building on the rock, y'all, not on the sinking sand. Pray for our family. We lost my father-in-law last week. We sure will, oh, Connie. Boy. Sorry we to will. hear that. Amen. That's one thing I want to pray about. I wonder if we all do the live on that, but we'll 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 pray about this. Oh, the Bible study. Yeah. So okay. We're still we're still thinking about yeah. that. So that's kind of going to be on me. So um, don't forget to drop in the comments, y'all. Share with other people. Um, I've been praying a lot about that. So, yeah. And not really getting fulfilled in the churches and having a hard time mm -hmm. finding that. I'm still still thinking about what God really wants us to do. So I'm just trying to be patient, you know. Yeah. Um, so you never know what we might do. I'm going to try to eventually uh, work through maybe people at the campground too. And, um, you know, to God be all the glory. So. If all hearts and minds are clear, y'all. Isaac, when you get back fishing, you catch some big fish. Oh, yep. we're going to go. Gary, we're going to go. Yep. <clears throat> I'll probably hoop and holler. Mama's got a big 30, 40 pounder <laughs> on the end of her pole. Yeah. So, That'd be nice. Thank you all. Thank you and, all. Uh, when YouTube sends us this, we'll know that we're able to be fishing because of you. Thank awesome. you. Thank you all. God bless y'all. God bless y'all. Have a good night. We love y'all. Good night.